Blessings from the throne of God. We thank God for the lovely and beautiful day that he has ushered over our lives. Bishop Professor Mugume Bagamba Kir Richard, my name is Bishop of Upper City Covenant Churches and also President and Chancellor of Oaks at the University, Kampala, Uganda, East Africa, and also WBF, World Bishop Council Federation Chapter, Uganda, representative. Blessing from the throne of God once again. Thank you, Patrick, Professor Josia, and Mami, and also the Holy Spirit Institute College, reaching to this remarkable year, reaching to this remarkable preparation for the graduation, the family members and the staff of Holy Spirit Institute College. It is an honor to be part of this celebration. And I celebrate you in Jesus' name on this lovely graduation ceremony at the Holy Spirit Institute College. So, it is such a pleasure to share in the intensity of emotions, feeling the solitarium. As you who are graduating close this chapter of your life story. Parents, you are probably wondering where the years have gone. As you marvel at your sons and daughters' accomplishments, it doesn't seem that long ago, when these young adults we honor today were toddling off to start the kindergarten, now they are becoming graduates. Of course, living through those years between kindergarten and also graduation that we are on today may have seemed like an eternity for the students and also for some parents as well. Glory to Jesus. You are the class of 2022 stroke 2023 graduates of today. And we thank God for that. You graduate in a century still in its infancy at a time in history when our world is dealing with enormous challenges. But at a time when the opportunities created by those challenges have never been greater at all. You are our today theologians and also technologists in the natives, born and also educated in a technology and theological world that was only found in the science fiction stories when many of us in this room were in school. You Twitter and tweet. You read books and the news online, and your electronic social networking has shrunk the known world. Glory to God, for Holy Spirit Institute College. You are the generation that will take the technology and the theology of today to new and dazzling dimensions. You are the ones who will bring salutations to environmental concerns, the global warmings, the conservation and the natural resources, and development of alternative energy sources God has blessed us with, the issues that may generation is only now identifying. And who knows, friends, there may come a time that some of you live on a space station circling the earth, Someone among you may find the cure of the spiritual cancer and also the physical cancer through the scriptures that you have gone through and the theology or other debilitating afflictions. So today you are poised to start a new chapter of your life's story. Amid with the skills and the knowledge you have attained, I can tell you are eager to tackle this next phase, whatever it might be. For some colleague, a technical schools will be your next stop. 
Some are heading straight to the work, the workforces that God has called you to. Some have chosen to become the gospel military service. You are now entering the field. So with those who are heading to the, the, the spiritual, physical, and uh, ministerial, military service, please stand if you take it and you feel it in your life. Please join me in, salut in saluting these individuals. You have done a great choice and a great decision that is remarkable both here and in eternal life. So whatever direction, friends, you take, I guarantee that your world will change us. You leave high school, and as a result of whatever it is you choose to do, our world, friends, will change as a result of your contributions. Contribution that will be determined by how you follow your dreams and imaginations. When we celebrate your past academic accomplishments and activities today, I want to challenge you to continue your quest for knowledge and to discover your own unique ways to contribute to our society. Although for some your next steps may have been determined, many of you may not yet know the direction your life will ultimately take. You may find a new calling in this next chapter, never had in your heart. Or it may be several chapters down the road. Who knows? God knows. So you may decide the direction you thought you were going just doesn't seem right. Or it is flat out, it isn't working. And you will begin to follow yet again another new road. Paul said that we celebrate everything in Christ. Some years ago, there was someone called J.K. Rowling. The creator of the Harry Potter books was addressing the 2008 graduating class at Harvard University when she said, Some failure in life is inevitable. It is impossible to live without failing at something unless you live so cautiously that you might as well not have lived at all in which case you fail by default. Can you imagine, friends, a life lived so cautiously that you have failed in life by default? I can't imagine any of you seated before me choosing to live life that cautiously with all the opportunities that lay before you. So friends, take risks. The gospel, the theological studies that you have studied may not be the way how you found it in books, but they are practicals. Apostle Paul, he sacrificed his life. Jesus Christ, he sacrificed his life, including his blood that he shed on the cross to wash us from our sins and make us new. Set goals. You have studied more than enough. Patriarch Professor Josiah, we trust him. That's why he looks at the university and throned him to be the professor because we know he's a theologian of the time and of the season. And he has done great work to prepare you and make you who you are. So don't misuse the chances and the times and the seasons that you have invested in and also harvested from Holy Spirit Institute College. Take the details that inevitably pop up and learn from them. You live in the greatest democratic society in the world, a place where you can worship as you wish. Gather where you want and pursue an opportunity that you happen upon regardless of your sex, your race, and also of your age. You are part of a global generation for which professional opportunities, recreational travel, and explorations may take you to the farthest reaches 
of the earth and beyond. I felt the joy as I watched you prepare for this ceremony. I saw you straighten each other cups and gowns. I saw the hugging, the high fives, the age old, the signals of friendship and caring. I say you are an unbridled enthusiasm for what you have accomplished. Glory to Jesus. So I want to challenge you to take that enthusiasm that surrounds you today out into the world with you and use it to obtain your goals. As you go forward, don't forget the friends you have made and those that you will also make along the way. They are very, very fundamental and the blessings into your life. True friendship is a treasure. And let me tell you, graduates, friends are made, friends are not found. It is only kids who just enjoy friendship for a second because of a sweet or a chocolate. But once you grow old, you understand that sold food is a matter. That's why Apostle Paul said that when I grow, I moved out of milk and start to enjoy the sold food. This is a graduation which wasn't a joke, but a blessing into your life. So treasure everything that you have earned in this season. Continue to care. Care about yourself, your family, your friends, and your world. Love it. And wherever the next chapter in your life story may take you, make sure your journey includes joy. Praise the Lord. In choosing or in my close-up, I would ask the, the graduates to join me in a round of applause for the family members and faculty of the Holy Spirit College and faculty who helped them reach this milestone. Thank you, Professor Josiah and Mami. And to those in the audience who are here to honor these fine, the fine young adults, please stand and also join me in saluting our 2022-2023 graduates of the Holy Spirit Institute College. Thank you very much for giving this opportunity and also hearing from me. I'm Bishop Professor Mugume Bagambaki Richard, my names. Glory and blessings of God. Happy New Year. We will welcome the other new academicians in this new learning cycle of 2023 Holy Spirit Institute College. God bless you. God keep you. In Jesus Christ's name, amen. Let's continue to enjoy the celebrations. Hallelujah.